Good morning, everyone. Look, there's that moon again. It's, uh, I don't know. It's not, not quite seven o'clock in the morning here. I just got back from my run, hence the um, super sexy. I'm, no, I'm not even gonna go there. I'm kidding. I'm hot and I'm sweaty and, and uh, I'm motivated though. I feel good. Um, on my run today, I actually ran with my girlfriend this morning who, if you've listened to my other challenges, my other days for this challenge, this most recent 90 day challenge reboot 3.0 for me, um, you might remember that she's an incredible athlete. So working out with her is, is always challenging because she pushes me just to keep up with her pushes me. Um, and she's had a little bit of a cold the last few days. So running was a challenge for her. And um, on this run, she was telling me like, okay, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna make it a little shorter than, than normal. So you keep going, I'm gonna turn around and, and head back to the house. And they stayed with us like, no, baby, me and you, like, we got this. I'm, I'll stay with you, whatever you want to do. And then every turning point we got to, every fork in the road, I would ask her, like, do you want to go straight or you want to turn? You want short or long? Um, and, and there are a couple of times she said, let's, let's go longer, you know? So I would take the longer route. And then we get to another fork in the road. And do you want to go shorter or do you want to go longer? And, um, and until we made it home. And um, it made me think about support and in that, and of course this is relationship, but take this to business, take this to friendships, take this to any kind of relationship. We each supported one another, um, as we always do. Um, you know, I asked her, you know, what, what do you, what do you need? What do you want to do? Do you, can you push yourself a little further or do you need to venture back home? And, um, and in, in her support for me, she was like, look, I'm going to take care of me, but you keep going. You don't need to stay with me. So if you want to get your three miles in, you go and I'm, I'm just going to probably cut this in half or just do a couple of miles. And so here's my question for you today in, in today's challenge. What do you have in your life's infrastructure and, and break this down if you want, or just take it one layer at a time. So you've got your professional and you've got your personal and you've got your physical and your mental health. What kind of support do you have right now that you can tap into today to challenge yourself to go a little further or push yourself a little harder or maybe meet a goal a little earlier or maybe set new goals? What does your support look like? Think about your entire life or think about just one of those tears. What support do you have right now? And then challenge yourself to think about saying out loud and write it down. What support do you need? What are you lacking? If we hadn't communicated on that run, I could have come home and been like, well, shit, you go for a run with me and, and we didn't get our three miles in. Or I could have pushed her to do three miles and she could have been like, well, shit, didn't you know I'm sick? So we communicated and we supported one another and in the end, we both got our needs filled. What do you need today? And what kind of support do you have built into your infrastructure? Ask yourself that, think about it, make it a beautiful day. I'm gonna go get some coffee. Take care.